Mrs Grey here. I'm going to read you a story called Dear Sue and it's written by Rod Campbell. Now, this is a story about somebody that writes a letter to the zoo because they want a pet. Let's see what happens. I wrote to the zoo to send me a pet. They sent me an... Hmm, I wonder what they sent me. It was very, very big and on the box it says very heavy. What could it be? It was an elephant. <coughs> he was too big. I sent him back. I wonder what was next. So they sent me a... Oh, this animal's got a very long neck very long legs and on the box it says fragile and that means you need to be very careful. He was too tall. Let's see what he is. It's a giraffe. Did you guess it was a giraffe? He was too tall so I sent him back. I wonder what the next animal could be. Oh, this looks like he might be a bit scary. They sent me a... A lion. He was too fierce. So I sent him back. What's next? What do we think is next? You might know this story already. So they sent me a... Ooh, this animal is... It's an animal that's unusual. It's got one hump on his back. Sometimes they have two humps. And they keep water in their humps. It's a camel. He was too grumpy. So I sent him back. The next one. Oh, this one's in a basket. I think it's coiled up. I wonder what it could be. Let's have a look. Oh, it's a snake. He was too scary. So I sent him back. Next, they sent me a... Oh, it's an animal that he likes bananas. This one's got a long tail. It rolls round like good at climbing trees. It's a monkey. He was too naughty. So I sent him back. So, they sent me a... Ooh, this is green. Ribbit, ribbit. He was too jumpy. He's a frog. So I sent him back. So they thought very hard and sent me a... Hmm, I wonder what would be a really good pet to have. Let's have a look, see if you're right. Oh, it's a dog. He was perfect. I kept him. There, that's the end.